Now to a major milestone for one of the most charismatic Catholic leaders in Western New York history. This marks the 80th year since the death of Father Nelson Baker. We get more on that now from 7 Eyewitness News reporter Paula Soro. As these bells ring, a special Sunday service begins in Lackawanna. A procession through the doors of Our Lady of Victory Basilica kicks off the 80th anniversary of Father Nelson Baker's death. Father Baker was more than just a Roman Catholic priest to those who knew him. He was a saint when he was here, alive on the, on the earth of Mother Earth. 93-year-old John Phillips is the oldest of the Baker boys, the man who grew up in the institutions Father Baker created. This church is home for Phillips, who was brought to Father Baker when he was just seven days old. He was another short guy, but he was a nice guy, though. For some of them, Father Baker was the only father that they knew. They were here as orphans or had been uh, neglected by their family. So he still is the only father that they knew. Father Baker left a legacy through the buildings that remain in place. With the exception of one year of his priesthood, he spent his whole uh, priesthood here uh, at what he called his city of charity. His city of charity came alive while he ran an orphanage, a reform school for boys, and Our Lady of Victory Hospital in the early 1900s. Some of the fondest memories are here. You hear these stories about, I'm going to send you to Father Baker's okay, alone. Great. It was a great institution. And if I could, I would send my kids here. Joe Ziskel, another Baker boy, carries this piece of paper around wherever he goes. Proud that he grew up on the street where Father Baker took care of children. Our school was great. The church made my first communion here. And we had great times. It's a great, great memories. The Baker boys closed the procession while holding a wreath to remember Father Baker and all he did for the Western New York community. While Father Baker's legacy remains intact, locally his canonization is still ongoing. Father Baker earned the title of Venerable from the Vatican back in 2011. That's the first of three steps towards sainthood. I spoke to Father Paul Burkard who said they are awaiting the confirmation of a miracle to make sure that Father Baker does get the next title, which would be blessed. And live in the newsroom, Paula Suro, 7 Eyewitness News. Thank you for that report, Paula.